The White Gate power station is very important to the energy infrastructure in Ireland. It's one of the newest combined cycle gas turbine plant on the island. It went into commercial operation in November 2010 and the asset has been running on an effectively a base load profile for the last six years. Its output contributes to about 10% of the energy supply to the island and is strategically located near the larger demand hubs of the Cork City as well. So it carries a lot of importance to the local industry for providing secure, reliable energy. It also carries a lot of importance to the local community. It employs people from the local area. It supports local businesses. It also requires a lot of local services and contract companies to support it. It's also got a very, very impressive performance record, so it's an important piece of infrastructure for the local grid. We've been in a relationship with GE from day one. Such a vast array of expertise and skills, particularly within power plants. GE supported us on the building of the power station. It's GE technology on our main powertrain, and we've got long-term service agreements to conduct the major maintenance overhauls required throughout the power station's life. So for us to advance and enhance the plant, it was key to us that anything we added to the plant complemented the existing systems We've had the full suite of upgrades and enhancements that have been available. Most recently, we've put in Asset Performance Management, APM. There's been many attempts before, but rarely with the scale of what GE is bringing. It's been in operation now properly for about 12 months. To date, it's been very successful. It makes this big data easy for the technicians, the engineers, the operators. It gives them an advantage in trying to understand what's going on, so it becomes a time-saving device as well as a very, very powerful tool for analysing your power plant health. One of the key benefits is the online condition-based monitoring. We have a live interface that's monitoring the plant and thankfully telling us most of the time that everything's okay, but equally it's very powerful in giving us early indications when things may not be okay and allows us to take a very proactive approach to rectifying their problems. An example of that is the turning gear motor that we've seen degrading over time. We've now been able to take a proactive approach of replacing that as opposed to waiting for that to fail. That's potentially a 1.2 million saving on forced outage costs and a possible additional 1 million on repeat failures in the future as well. Ultimately, we see it going to is that we will have reduced O&M costs also. We want to see what we're saving, where we're saving it, and a lot of that will come through the visual monitoring of key KPIs, key measures, key parameters that give us maximum confidence because if the reliability is good, if our forced outage is down, we will be fully optimised and we'll be doing the right things at the right times in the future.